Welcome in. Thank you for joining us. It's Tuesday. I'm Shelby Myers. Lanise has the afternoon off. Well, first and for the Mobile City Council voting unanimously today to approve a contract to demolish the Civic Center. In addition, the council paving the way for the completion of the design of its replacement. Foxen's Brendan Kirby is at the Civic Center as it stands now with the latest on all of this. And Brendan, this is really going to happen pretty fast. Yeah, it really is, Shelby. City officials say that workers are going to start preliminary work, such as clearing asbestos, within the next couple of weeks. And then after that, the demolition work would begin in earnest, probably by the end of August. Now, the council today approving it, that contract worth almost $4.4 million of the company called Sabre Demolition to carry out that work. The council also voted to allow the architectural firm that has the contract for the design work to finish that work for a new arena. It's part of a new of a $300 million master plan to build a state of the art multi use facility that includes a little more than a million dollars to preserve a pair of murals inside the building. Mayor Sandy Stimson says that those will be stored temporarily at the convention center and then returned once the new facility is built. Beyond that are two projects that at the same site that is not included in the 300 million. That's a new regional headquarters for the Army of Corps of Engineers and a city owned parking garage. Both are underway. Major milestone because um, if I think as I think back over the last several years of trying to get to where we are now, I mean, the, the number of questions that we have answered about this council, previous council, I mean, just I mean, this has been going on for a while. Construction on the new arena is expected to begin early next year. There's an auction underway online for some of the items that are still inside the building. And Mayor Stimson says that he's looking into the possibility that people could perhaps buy bricks from the building as souvenirs. Reporting live in Mobile, Brendan Kirby, Fox 10 News.